my viewers about Starship Troopers and how did you come about the role and are you surprised at how much of a cult movie it's become and everything? So? As far as Starship Troopers is concerned, it's got to be uh, one of the biggest surprises of my life. I had no idea that uh, 15 years later people would look at me and scream from across the street, hey, Starship Troopers guy. I mean, you know, I actually, during that time I, I did about five big movies back to back all had huge releases, they were all number one in the box office, and who was to know which one was going to hit, and Starship Troopers, in fact, didn't do very well in the box office, but the cult following that right. it has right. is, I mean, it did well in the box office, 70 million or something bad. like that, yeah, but yeah, yeah. not against the 150 it cost to make or whatever, but it was one of those things where we had a good time making it, it was a great experience all around, never knew it would have this cult following status, and, uh, it's interesting to be like, let's start shooting. It's weird. So, what projects are you involved in right now and what's coming up for your future? Right on, uh, right now, developing a film called Sweet Ride. It's a romantic comedy that I'll be directing and it takes place in New York. Huh. And, uh, sort of a remake of an old classic that I can't really talk about all the way, but uh, it's, I'm very excited to be moving into directing films and, and not just acting in them. It's something I've always wanted to do to just to fulfill that cliche. Um, being how I grew up, I always had a camera in my hand. I always had a, I was filming my friends, filming them skateboarding and myself, whatever, skating on, on a half time. Are you more of a visualization guy or a plan guy? You know, some people when they plan out, some people, when they, some people plan out their show. Yeah, yeah. I'm both. I'm kind of messed up. Visualization and planning, but, you know, like when I read a script, I see it. I see the whole movie. I see all the, the camera angles, all the shots. I did a couple of ultra low budget movies for friends for favors this year for fun. Um, and when they came to me to ask them to help them direct it, I started realizing, wait, um, this is something I've always wanted to do and I, I need to be doing it because here I am being directed by someone who really doesn't know what he's doing. Uh, and I don't know, I realized that I had a talent that was lying there in wait and I'm really excited for it. Hey, what's your website? My website, I, it's, I mean, I have a Facebook page. Oh, okay. I got a jakebusey.com, and it's right. kind of a silly little thing I did. I, got, I do the Twitter thing, yeah. Right, cool, all right. You know, so. What's your Twitter handle? It is uh, the Jake Busey. There's a lot of fakes, but mine's the Jake Busey. Yeah. Hey, your, your dad, I'm supposed to buy him a drink. Oh, you are? Yeah. <laughs> well, he'll probably take a Coca-Cola, a Diet Coke, or a Sprite. Yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> It's an honor to meet you. Nice to meet you. Yeah,